I am Chase Fisher. I am a system analyst at True, and my daily jobs normally consist of dealing with the core, with the member information and automating that connectivity, you know, through our digital banking, things like that. Before we migrated and before we had OpCon, there were a lot of processes that were done manually uh, with maybe like one little script to run to try and help you get through it. We decided to do a migration for our core a few years ago. That was recommended for us to move forward for automation and uh, security purposes. We use it from anything to make our jobs easier if possible. Uh, that includes ISO moves, uh, so backups of the servers. I think a lot of the benefits of having workflows like that are you can build in a lot of like, different notifications, alerts, like let's say a job fails, but it fits out with a certain error code. You can then customize it to say, okay, that's fine. Now, now do this you know, or retry in 10 minutes or whatever you need it to do. It's so customizable to a level that I don't know the full scope, but to me, there's not much you can't do with it. I don't have to worry about it. I really can just let that roll off my shoulder, let it go and be trustworthy that I'll be notified if anything were to happen. Opcon has that timing and it started at this time. It's running, it's doing this, provides you with the process that it's using inside of the core. It really bridges the gap between all of our networks and servers. If we're not sure how to do something, well then we, we run it with that purview of OpCon in mind. Can it do it? How would we want to accomplish that? OpCon helps our internal members, our employees, by saving them time doing their jobs. It really helps take some of the difficultness out of it because if there's a certain flow or process, it will do that every time no matter what, unless we tell it to do otherwise. I feel like the member experience without OpCon would just be like slower. You know, potentially I would have to be up earlier that day, you know, because I know that I have a manual process that might run a lot longer. Whereas I could sleep, let Opcon run while I'm sleeping, wake up and then see that it's already gone. I would say that Opcon runs about three to 600 jobs a day. And then monthly, I would say probably a little under 10,000. Working with SMA is really refreshing. I know I can rely on my customer service. Like if I send off an email, they're on top of it, getting back to me right away. I mean, personally, like, I can't imagine not having OpCon now. Like, it's just that much of a powerhouse. If you have the ability to obtain it, do it. Like, if I could have it in my personal life, I would. <laughs> There's so many things that I would automate from bills to standard backups at home, you know, and I might be a nerd, but it's something that I've always thought about. Like, I would love to have that at home.